talking about? You ain't talking about nothing. Then what you talking about? Gangsta moving silent. And I don't talk a lot. I don't say a word. I don't say a word. So my grind and I got what I deserve. Hold on, wait a minute. Y'all thought I was finished? Hello, Parkside. My name is Jason, and I'm a sophomore, and I'm here with... Hi, my name is Sharon Matthew. I am a sophomore here at Parkside also. How are you, Sharon? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. How much do you know about James Edward West? Is he the guy with the peanut? <laughs> no, the guy with the peanuts is George Washington Carver. James Edward West is the co-inventor of the electric microphone. Uh, I didn't know much about him. Let me put you on then. Uh -huh. Born in Farnsville, Virginia, February 10th, 1993, the electrical engineer James Edward West, who was the son of Samuel Edwards, a funeral home owner, insurance salesman, and porter for the Baltimore, Ohio Railroad. Oh, that's interesting. What about his mother? His mother, Matilda West, was a teacher and a World War II Air Force worker. <laughs> Bro, what? They are some fighters for real. For real. But his idea to invent the microphone didn't even come from his parents. Hmm. While he worked at Bell Laboratories, him and a co-worker named Gerhard Sessler created a small microphone that did not use batteries. They didn't use any batteries? No. This microphone revolutionized communications technology and replaced the carbon microphone. By, 2020, by 2011, 90% of microphones technology had the foundation of West development of the electric microphone. Wow, I never knew that. Interesting, right? <laughs> yeah. He really did revolutionize microphones. He really did. Today we use an older one, a newer one, and even my phone. So the next time you make that face some call, make sure you thank Mr. James U.S. for the invention of the electric microphone. Happy Black History Month, Farside. See ya.